Drop whatever you're doing. Meet me at the marina. Don't make me wait. Say no more. I'm on my way. In for a real treat, V. Uh, Night City Marina, Pier 4. Scallywag. Care to come aboard? Ahoy back at you. What's going on? Up for a cruise around the bay. Kicking in with old Carrie. What's the occasion? New beginnings and life's loops. Life's loops? V, please don't make me ruin the surprise. You coming or not? Okay, yeah. Sounds promising. I'm in. Music to my fucking ears! Off we go! Now if I can find that button to raise... Dad. Fucking... Seamurai. All ahead! Nice axe. It's a Lancaster, custom built. Only five ever made in this series. I got one. The old tech chief's got another. The other three, yeah, fuck them, I know. It's tailored with a reverse polarity pickup, ebony frets, and one silky smooth Kaimar vibrato. And see this rusty color on the strings? It's supposed to be the blood of legendary blues man Dennis Ford himself. Okay, so let me hear what this is all about. Like I said, life's loops. Uh, breakfast cereal? No, 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 no. Loops. Cycles. One chapter ends, another begins. Life's full of them. At least my guru tells me so. Your guru? Yeah. 
I've got spiritual needs. Visit Kian every couple of years. You know, he's got this yurt in Tangland. Middle of fucking nowhere. Off grid, net blockers included. Our last meet, Kian told me that the time for closure, loop completion, had come. That's why we're here. You and me. I'll bite. Tell me about these loops. Okay. So, first tune I ever wrote that was worth a damn. I wanted to see. And you notice? Fingers are on to something fresh again today. There's a loop for you. What was that little number? I know it. Bleed the beat. And I wrote it during a cruise ship game. Decks, pools, more pools, buffets, shrimp, you know, bells and whistles. Everybody thinks the song's about sticking it to corporal fascistas. But actually, it's... Didn't just make music on that boat. Busted my ass, serving drinks, waiting tables. Free time, I, I composed till my fingers bled. I had to watch out not to stain their precious porcelain. And there it is. A song about bleeding in service of the rich. People hear what they want to hear, though. But man, was that a hit. One of Samurai's biggest. Just like this one would be. Fresh, raw, real. And you need company for that? Not just your company. I needed you, me. Been thinking about that us cracks fiasco lately. About how you helped me. A lot. You shake things up, V. Make me feel... I, I, I mean, before you came along, I was stuck in the mud. Scared of my own shadow, even. And now? Got me thinking about a new song. A new album, even. Thrasher with a new soul. Make everything from now on. Had what I think folks call an epiphany. Could just be what folks call maturity. You'll see. No more mayhem, no more shady ass schemes. Done with that. Well, starting tomorrow. Fucking help me, or just stand there like a gawk? Chaos and destruction. Why the fuck not? Grab something heavy. And no regrets after owning a trashed yacht. My yacht? Honestly, think I'd name my boat Seamurai. Fuck. The fucker L.P. Kovacek. Kovacek. That's Kovacek. Mm-hmm. Never got a chance to properly thank you. We crossed the crack and a few other things. Do something and smash it. This one's on LP. Okay, let's rip this boat to shreds. Well, well. Finally ready to part. Either he's gone senile or he's finally wising the fuck up. Could be either.
I'm all right. Still got a little left in you? Remember when you woke up in that scrapyard? That's where he is now, being reborn with fuck all to stop it. It's time for the grand finale. Do the honors, V. Huh, baptism by fire and water. A fucking man. The settling scores. Well fucking said. Suck on this, Kovacek! Race you to the beach! I ought to start using my own pool more often. Come here, kid. Just hold your breath a little ways. Reeks something real. Beautiful, isn't it? Somebody has to have seen the smoke by now. If the Seamurai sails another day, I'm gonna rip my hair out. I think I should have let him more barrels. Or come with Black Market C6. What do you think? <sighs> Never mind. I had fun. You? Gotta admit, not bad. It was fucking wild. This is what I needed. To settle that score? to mark a new beginning. Thanks, V. Ah, oh, hell of a night, huh? Felt like Samurai's first few gates. A little stop the rhythm. The energy was fucking raw. <laughs> nice twist of events. I gotta admit. All right. Let's get out of here before the wind flips and we get flooded by that stench. Need a ride? Of course I do. It's Blue Moon from Us Cracks. You know, the band. Whole of Night City knows you. What's cracking? I've got a problem. I... Wait, you mean you're not calling me to ask me to be your backup dancer? <laughs> Just kidding. What can I do you for? It's about a fan of mine. The, um, the weirder variety. I've been getting death threats. A lot of them. All sent to my private address. I'm also being followed. I can't just wait around until something bad happens. We have to find him and deal with him. I don't know how much you charge me, but I'm prepared to pay whatever the cost. Believe me. Happy to help out. Gary was right. Thanks. Chill. So, I've got a plan. I'll go for a little stroll, like looky roundabout, while you hang back. Watch out for any signs of trouble. You catch something suspicious, like you see the guy, and you're a hundred percent sure it's him. I'll know what to do. No, no, wait. We're not killing anyone here. That would be bad for the band's like PR and stuff. All we want to do is teach him a lesson. Oh, whatever. Awesome! So, just go to Kabuki, sit on the bench, and wait for me. I'll come to you.
Sorry, uh, could I get a picture with you? I'm a huge fan. Sure! What's your name? Huh? Green Cloud?
My lips! They're burning! Hot! 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 <laughs> what is that? Oh, Pearl. Look, we've been everywhere. Maybe he isn't here. Let's just forget it, B. I'll tell Red Menace to pick us up. Supposed to kill anyone, but uh, maybe it's for the best. Agreed. Listen, I'll hang back and make sure nobody spills to the media vultures. Oh, and your fee, of course. I'll transfer it the second I get home. Promise. No rush. See you later, Blue Moon. Watch your back. at all this porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news listen first sign of trouble be delta hanako sama ga omachida she emptied the place Shit. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You... knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate. Inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Huh. Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm-hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. What changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout. When my brother's assault group arrived, not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. 
He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge. Something got you spooked? I... don't know. Three times now, that AP has flown by. Think someone might have told you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itaraite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. No wish to, or no permission, you being a woman. I decide my own fate. As should you. So... Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, yeah. It's just dumb. You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. No worries. About that. You could use some air. Right now. <laughs> Listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Yeah, I get it. I don't like it one bit. I'm still going Come on, strong. Face the facts. Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. 
I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Yeah? How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you half a century ago, but now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find a way inside Mikoshi. It's our only chance. And what about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen, I know you and Pan Am got a thing going. I get it. I do. But that's what makes it such a shitty idea. You don't want to rope her into this. Made the same mistake myself once. You don't want those people involved, their lives on the line, possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offer's on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, cut the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Yeah, one-way ticket to the city morgue. That suck a cunt scrambled your circuits. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Honestly, think it could work. With her experience, her resources, her connections. Won't find anyone better in NC. Damn it's me. gotta work. We breach the tower, the vault cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? Sensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. Uh, feels like. Someone's using your head as a knife block? How. How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table. ...and demanded you be treated immediately. Talman was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... ...wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up, carefully. Okay, but don't expect a miracle. Ah! Sit slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Hmm. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Take matters into my own hands? The fuck you think I've been doing? Well, whatever it is, it keeps landing you on my table. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah, 
What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo endo in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. You got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Enough, Johnny. I just gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, just in, not this in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Well, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Say, who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh, was it? No, nope. never does. Meaning? It's a rerun. One I'd like to go back to. Why'd you get so mad, then? If you already knew who won. Oh, no, really. Guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but it feels a little strange to call that a mistake. I can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. Close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there, too. Good luck, kid. V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. And let me guess. My aura is sputtering. Mm-hmm. Afraid so. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. 